Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we continue on the wonderful world of not Vladimir Putin. Definitely not. We have our secret mustache hiding ourselves. We are definitely not Vladimir Putin. We are, however, invading Lithuania because we have the ambition to become king. And to become king, we have to conquer a whole lot of crap. So let's continue conquering crap. Conquer, conquer, conquer. I made you out of clay. With conquer, conquer, conquer. With conquer, I shall play. Oh, we're so good at singing, not Vladimir. Oh, a son! We have a son! Stanislav! No, 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 not Stanislav. We're obviously not Vladimir. We have a son! And he has no special traits at all. He's not a hunchback, he's not a dwarf, and he's not a genius. He's perfect. Uh, princess... Vyacheslava has made me promise I would bury her properly. Oh, she died. She was so good. Crap. Well, he's not bad. My half-brother actually is pretty good. All right, half-brother, you're going to uh, proselytize. We have some converting to do. You will not be forgotten. My goodness. We stood down all of our regular troops. We're just using some mercenaries to siege. Because it's easier this way. And it's not like they really have a whole lot of uh, defense. We're at war with Zemit. Zemit. D whatever. I can't pronounce that. We'll just call it Zemit. We're at war with Zemit. <laughs> But yeah, it shouldn't take too long. We're going to be attacking when these guys are not able to call in their allies. Like right now, when the text is read, their allies cannot be called in. So that's our that's our time to strike, baby. Let me check on our vassals and everything. Oh, one of our vassals has gone. Oh, no, we have some unhappy vassals. Oh, we'll have to fix that. Diligent. Yay, we got diligent. That ups our traits. Nice. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, sometimes when your people yell at you, good things happen. Oh, he's the wrong religion. That's what's going on. Look at that funny mustache. What the fuck? Is it just me, or is that mustache crooked? I wish I could zoom in on that guy right now. I think his mustache is crooked. Oh, paradox. You and your crazy faces. Uh. Anywho. We have some vassals who are Romuva, and that's that's kind of a problem. Yeah, Romuva. I think we're going to have to Romuva him. We're going to have to ro Romuva the Romuva guys, because that's just unacceptable. Motherfucking Romuva. Can you... Oh, we can't demand conversion. Oh, you can't demand conversion if they're an unreformed pagan. Interesting. Okay. So we have to reform the the Slavic faith, we are Slavic, we have to reform the Slavic faith before we can demand conversions from people. Okay, understood. Uh, should we go slaughter his army? Yeah, go slaughter his army and then come back. Oh, don't run away. Damn it, he's gonna make it too. Gotcha, bitch. I love fighting with mercenaries. Oh, we're at 100%. Perfect. Done. Hey, one battle got us 100%. Next. Mr. My allies can't join because I'm busy. Oh, is that not everything? Oh, that's not part of Lithuania. What is that part of? That is part of Finland. Really? Okay, well. Apparently, uh, Kalevan and Narva are part of Finland. Well, the more you know. Oh, what's this? What is this? Press ducal claims. Hmm. Oh, and these guys actually become straight up vassals. <gasps> oh, I became a duke! I became a duke. When did I become a duke? 
the Duchy of Samogitia. Hmm. I didn't even notice I had become a duke. I am now a duke. That means when we conquer these people, they get to keep their counties. So where's the de jure Samogitia? Right here. Okay, so when I kicked this guy when I took this guy's land, I also took his title, I guess. I'm not super sure how that works, but okay, I'm a duke. I'm a duke. What's up, bro? I brought Mercs. Did you bring Mercs? No? Because I brought Mercs. Oh, my half-brother Vladimir asked for a fief to govern. I think we could arrange that. Sure. Let's find the shittiest piece of shit in our territory. There you go. Lepiel is pretty trash. Lepiel, you're gonna go to my brother. My half-brother. Half-brother. Hello. Enjoy. Ooh, a level 22 diplomat. Nice. He's the wrong religion, but whatever. You're doing God's work now. Train the troops, baby. We can press claims uh, Skalovia and Mamel. Oh. We inherited the county of Lepiel. As soon as I gave him the county, he died. Interesting. Well then. That means your wife is available. She's still in my court. I kind of want to marry her, because she's got that claim on the kingdom. The problem is the king is pretty strong again, right? He's taken another county. Yeah, he's at fourth. I can't fight that right now. The, the prime time to fight the king would have been when he was losing the war to Hungary. Now is not the time, so I don't really care about that claim at this moment. Uh, but maybe, maybe you'd like to marry my son? She'll be old by then, though. I don't even care. You're going to marry my son, woman. Why? So that we can get the kingdom some point down the road. In the meantime, keep getting that guy to like me. What's this? Uh, you inherited some county. Okay. <gasps> wife is preggers. Okay. Damn wife. Kill her. Using this option is viewed as tyrannical. Ah, oh, shit, that's expensive. Uh, I just don't want more babies. One baby is enough. It really is. Yeah, we're gonna kill the wife. Nothing personal, wife. Oh, yeah. Psh. Everyone's on board. Kill the wife. Ten more gold, very good. Come on, kill the wife. Hey, you, stop recruiting troops. I didn't say you could do that. Son of a bitch, he's recruiting troops. Oh well, means his forts are empty. What's up, bro? Oh, wow. That battle was worth like 30 war score. Shit, I had a daughter. No, that's fine. She won't screw up our inheritance. She's not a boy. You don't have a penis? 
It's all good. Everyone does want her dead. You're right. Look at that. Everyone wants her dead. Oh, someone told her about it. Uh. Oh, she doesn't seem to care. Now she cares. Oops. You found me out, woman. You found me out. Approve the plan. Yes. My co-conspirator, Mayor Izislav, 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 has procured a poisonous viper. Yes. Just don't put it in my bed. Put it in her bed. We, we have separate beds. Oh. Gained a tithe of 24.8 gold. I like that. Yay! She died! Beautiful day. She was too busy dealing with the contending string of lethal snake attacks to deal with those responsible. I could kiss that snake! Well, may maybe not. But yes! Yes, 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 yes. Oh, oh, see, we're going to... Uh... Oh, hold on. Now that I betrothed her, I want to get her. Well, you know what? We don't need the marriage right now. We don't need the marriage. As long as she's betrothed to my son, we don't really need the marriage. Not a big deal. What's this? Ruler unmarried. You should get married. All right, let me marry someone really old. Uh, 34. Is that the oldest woman out there? Let me find an older woman. Uh, ah, here we go. 45. Let's uh, make it unmarried. Nope. Women. Well, we do like men. But yeah, women, unmarried. Find me someone about 44. There you go. 43, 45. You want to get married? I can't. So we can't marry someone if she's 45. What about 44? No, you can't do it. Well, that just sucks. I don't want any more babies. Fuck it. Okay, 75%. Move on to his capital. How much do we need anyway? No, not yet. He may want 100%, but I don't think we want to go to 100%. Oh, is this some other guy? Oh, was this guy revolting? Independence League. Oh, he's dealing with revolt. I kind of want him to finish that revolt. Oh, did I kill too many of his troops? Oh, shit. If I peace out now, then this guy will still be at war and I won't get his land. I wanted his land. Oh, shit. How's Hungary doing against his revolts? He's winning. What's this? You want my sister to marry some idiot? Sure. Whatever. Oh, she was my diviner. Oh, well. Oh, what's this? Russian subjugation of Lithuania. Oh, he's attacking Corland. Oh, shit. Stay away from me, Russia. I mean, stay away from me, Corland. Oh, he's just going to siege me up. That's fine. I can walk around. So Russia is attacking for these two. He wants that county. Or that duchy. I'll just stay out of his way. It's not my battle. 83%. No peace. Okay. I think the problem is he can't siege down this fort over here with only 113 people. No, there's no way. There's like 800 people there. Hmm. Look at this bastard. He's not even see he's not even going to kick them off my lands. He's not even going to kick them off my lands. Motherfucker. He's just going to avoid them. I'm starting to think Igor might fancy me. 
Oh, this is our childhood friend. Make a move. Don't need no wife. I went to Igor's chamber and gave him a good tumble. It's good to be the high chief. Yeah, we're definitely homosexual. Poor not Vladimir. All right, well, there's 100%, but if we peace out, we won't get that island. It's probably okay. I'll just declare a separate war on him, I guess. He's not independent, though. It says he's a vassal. So, I don't know. Let's just take the peace and move on. Oh, no, we did get the land. Okay, I was worried we wouldn't get the land, but we did. Okay, that worked. Now, we're over our limit, so we're going to have to deal with that. I guess now is not the right time to deal with that. Let's go attack this idiot. No? High Chief of Yatvikas. Yeah, but that's so tiny. Thousand. How many troops? Four hundred. We'll probably be okay, I think. How many troops can we raise? 800. All right, raise them. Hold on. You're actually attacking me? Why are you doing this? I'm going to win. This guy's an idiot. We lost. Are you kidding? We lost that? Really? Oh, Jesus. That hurts me. In the pit of my stomach. Whatever. Not my battle. Righteous imprisonment. Oh, who's this? Chief Booby Lost the Chast, our vassal. Uh, he's the leader of a plot. Let's take a look what this plot is. Kill High Chief, not Vladimir of Samogidio. Whoa! And look who signed up for this. Some of our vassals and shit. Hey! Hey, you bitch. You son of a bitch. The High Chief of Ingria. Oh! That's our brother's wife. Our brother's wife is plotting to kill us. End your plot. No. Oh, you bitch. 23% chance to assassinate her. Wow. I can't believe that. My brother's wife is trying to have me killed. That's just not cool. That is just uncool. Hmm. Okay, lower the troops. There we go. We'll let the mercenaries recover a bit. They're down about 400 troops. Do you have any money? Oh yeah, he does have money. Hmm. His forts don't have a whole lot in them though. That bitch is trying to murder us. Hmm. Looks like my uh, spy master is kicking people out of the plot. This is good. Oh, he won't. He will not be kicked out of this plot. He's my direct vassal. He's the chief of Samogidia. Oh, he's pissed because I took his duchy away. This was the man with the duchy. The man with the plan. I had a duchy once. It was cool. Hmm. Well, we own our duchy entirely. We should probably give some stuff away. Because we're over our limit.
Wow, that is a big duchy. Duchy of Homegarder has, what, six provinces? Wow, that's a big duchy. It's nice, too. Hmm. Duchy of Estonia. Okay. And this is the Duchy of Samogit. So we have free CBs on these guys. Interesting. Trying to think like, trying to think like where we should have our capital, which duchies we should hold on to personally, because you can have two duchies personally, right? We currently have Livonia and Samogitia personally. Hmm. Collect in the capital, please. There you go. I would love him to waste his money on something. Because he could hire 1,500 mercs right now. And I would kind of prefer if he didn't. So, spend your money. Go build... I don't know. Build a moat. Build a fortress. Do something. Spend your money, little brat. Oh, wow. Hungary is devolving into a rebel city. Uh, how are you doing on those rebels? Well, one of them, the king is winning. And one of them, the rebels are winning. So, it you know, the court is out. But we'll see. We will see. We could still create the Duchy of Polotsk if we wanted. Ah, screw it. I'm just going to go for it. Little brat. Yeah. Oh, he wants peace. That's cute. Wow, 67% war score for that one battle. <laughs> That's awesome. A tithe! 28 gold. Very nice. Not Vladimir will be so proud. Well, there goes that war. He just took the Duchess into prison. Yeah, but we're not over the duchy limit yet. We only have two, which is the limit. <laughs> uh, let's check our vassals' opinions. Uh, some of them are happy. Some of them, not so much. But I think it's, a, it's more of a religious problem than anything else. And we can overcome a religious problem. Ninety-eight percent. You want peace yet, bro? No, 98% is not good enough for the AI. They need 100% before they'll take peace. Even though we're only demanding one province. Faction leader. Two hundred thirty-three men, four hundred and eighteen men. Yeah, you got the king to like us. Good. Okay, you want peace yet, you little brat? Good. You're now my vassal. Hey, you're my vassal, and you hate my guts. I don't care. Your allies cannot join you, so now's a good time to beat you up. You do have a thousand troops, though. But, uh, I think it's fine. Come on, raise your troops. Oh, I think he already has raised his troops. Well, maybe not. We're just getting vassals here. Some of the land we're taking for ourselves, and some of the land are going to go to vassals. How's our kid doing? He's five. Okay, good. There he is. Now he's six. And the little not Vladimir is turned six years old. We need to educate him. Let's find someone who needs a hug. 
like you. Actually, let's find someone who uh, will give us some money. If we can give him a tutor. There we go. This guy, the Priest of Eerie. The Priest of Eerie. Then he'll give me his money. There he is. There you go. The only problem is the religion thing. He's not my religion, is he? No, he's not. Oh, shit. Yeah, I am concerned about religion flipping. I don't want religion flipping. So, we'll go with the lowest opinion guy who is still Slavic. Him or her. You got it. Well, no, no, no. This is going to be my heir. Shit, this is going to be my heir. I need diplomacy. I need diplomacy and stewardship. It looks like we can't have both. we got to have one or the other. God damn. And he's Romuva. Really? The highest diplomatic Slavic guy we have is only 10 diplomacy? Holy shit. Alright, hold on. Let's see if we can get someone else to tutor him. What about you? You would make him Norse. But my god, look at that martial skill. Hmm. Russian Slavic. Oh, yeah, this guy's perfect. You want to tutor my kid? He does have room for another ward. Please tutor my kid. What's your name? Chief Svitgupdablar. Can we not do that? No, it looks like we can. There he is. Yes. 22 diplomacy. Do it. And he's a great eminence. Yes! Tutor my kid! Yeah! Beautiful. Thank you. Oh, because there's no one in my court who's worth a damn. So, let's use the other guy. And he's Russian Slavic, so that's perfect. Oh shit, we're getting attacked. Oh shit! Raise the troops! Hang in there, bros. We got backup coming. Hang in there. Oh, we're not hanging in there. It's okay. We got backup coming. It's going to be all right. Yes. More troops, baby. Oh, you want to have me do something, eh? What, steward? Yes, I'll be your steward. Sure. There we go. God, it's tough. It's tough to fight these idiots. Alright, let's take the... Uh, You guys, follow him. Kill him. There we go. Perfect. Why are we at war with Byzantine Empire? No, really. Why are we at war with the Byzantine Empire? The Holy War for Moesia. We're also at war with the Holy Roman Empire. Oh, goody! They're best friends. Really? You guys are allies? No, you're not allies. Well, then why are you... Oh, yes, they are. They are allies. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
Okay, Byzantines and Romans, you just stay the fuck away from me, okay? I don't want to deal with that shit. Holy crap. As long as they don't come up here and slaughter me, I'll be fine. <laughs> oh. We're losing horribly. Oh my god, negative 44? Wow, where is Moise? Oh, right here. This area. Oh yeah, look at that. He's got like 30,000 guys. It's crazy. Yep, keep relations up with that guy. Good. Verkoslava is not satisfied and keeps asking for more toys to play with. She's greedy. Let's see if we can get her diligent. She got cynical. Whatever. Aha! Hungary has surrendered to some rebels. Turov is independent. Wow, look at that. Hungary's losing. Turov, you have allies, don't you? How many troops can you raise, Turov? 557. Eh? Do I have a CB on you? I do not have a CB. Oh, shit. We got some prisoners. That's always nice. And can we split this in half? There we go. Because we don't need tons of people to siege that anymore. It's only the high, the, the high holding, the, uh, the fortress that has a lot of troops in inside of it. The cities and the and the uh, the castle has troops. The cities and the temples don't. What's this? Educate child. You want this moron to educate my son. Uh, no, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I can't do that. Refuse steward stewardship. Yeah, or refuse guidance. Yeah, well, I'm sorry. Oh, wow. Our mustache has grown. Our mustache has grown mighty. Mighty mustache. Letter rot. Hey, can I do any, any more prison selling? Prisoner selling. Yes, I can. There you go. Ten gold. Ten gold. There you go. Yeah. I'm all about the ten gold, baby. Twenty-six gold. Nice. Very nice. Okay, we're done with Grodno. 67%? That won't be enough. He wants 100%. He's greedy. He needs 100%. He's a 100% kind of guy. So what's going on in Europe? Holy Roman Empire is looking nice. West Francia seems to have split. Yeah, Aquitaine is free again. Uh, Asturias is all but gone. Byzantium, Byzantium is looking good. The Abbasids are looking strong. Who's this? My daughter? Yep, my daughter needs some tutoring. Well, whoever needs some, uh, some moral, I don't know, boost in opinion. There you go. But only Slavic counts. Anyone who's not Slavic does not count. Alright, let me get the non-mercenaries out. Oh, wow, that's that's very easy now. All right, take the non-mercenaries out. We'll stand them down. Excellent. Oh, man, that's so easy. I've never used that button before, split off special troops. That worked great. And that's pretty much everything in Lithuania. We just need this one last province. Do you have any allies? Seven allies, yeah. But none of them can help. Oh shit, he's allied to Hungary. 
But none of them can help. They're all busy. As long as that remains true, we can just go stomp them flat. 99, is that good enough? No. 99 is not good enough. 99 might as well be zero. How many troops you got, bro? Bro? 400. Perfect. That's what I like to hear. Okay, are we done here? We're done here, right? Good. Excellent. Excellent. What's this? Vassal inheritance warning. There are vassals with some worrisome lines. Chief of Vilnius. Your heir is... High Chief of the Yetvigs. Well, I guess we'll have to go take him out then, won't we? Won't we? Yes, we will. Norse pagans can take any coastal county. Pagans can conquer any single border counties without specific reasons. Oh, I like that a lot. Alright, siege him up. Wait, someone else was called in. Who's this? The Krivians. Where the fuck is the Krivians? I don't even know. Yeah, rebels are doing pretty well over here. Hungary's falling apart. Poor Hungary. They used to be somebody. A destitute noble from a former enemy asks for permanent hospitality. Welcome to the court. Alright, so let me see this soldier guy. What you got for me, bro? You, right? Oh, shit. I didn't mean to put you in... Oh, shit. I didn't mean to put him in there. That's what she said. Well, whatever. He'll die soon. Uh, I wanted just to go to his portrait. So he has a claim on Vitebsk. That's why he came to my court. Okay. Mr. Claims on Vitebsk. Good for you. Do you want a medal or something? I got claims on Vitebsk. I'm special. Sure you are. Fucking special. Oh, Hungary. 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 Oh, he's in four wars now. Hungary's fucked. Hungary is F asterisk C-K-E-D. In the ass. With a spoon. But yeah, I think we've done well for ourselves. And uh, we've made Gartharicki a lot stronger. We won't be their vassal forever. Right? The moment we create our own kingdom, we won't be a vassal anymore. I think this will give us enough land to create the kingdom. Not sure. We'll see. Oh, there's the Krivians. Ah, Vitebsk. Gotcha. Now oh, we could go annex them, I guess. But that's part of Rus, isn't it? No, that's part of Ruthenia. Yeah, I should go get that. Alright, 100%, baby. Beautiful. Beautiful. And since we use that particular causes Billy, we took all of the holdings. So we can create our own dude here. This is important that we're able to do this. Uh, I don't know. Let's pick some randomer in our court who is Russian Slavic and he's not ambitious or anything. There you go. Wait, you're not an heir, are you? No. You get yet whatever. Okay. No, we still can't create the kingdom. What the hell do we need for the kingdom? No 
no, no, not the empire. The kingdom. You need to control 51%. Oh, we cannot create or usurp a title of the same or higher rank as our liege. Gotcha. So we can't create the kingdom because our our, our liege is a king. Well, poop. But these guys are in there. Do you have any allies? Why, yes, but uh, none of them really matter. How many troops you got, bro? Oh, 1,100. Eh? Uh, I'll have to save that for next time. But thank you guys for joining me. I have been Shen. You have been you. Sorry for the longer episode here, but I was hoping to hit the button to form the kingdom. At the end of it, we simply can't do it because our, our liege is a king. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.